Hello Bearcats, so it's finally IASA's Touch and Rugby. Now a lot of us know that because of a very unfortunate event in GIST, ISM is now hosting IASA's Touch and Rugby. Now, I don't know about you guys, but I find it extremely inspiring and heartwarming how rival schools who compete in various academic, athletic, and artistic events throughout the year are just so quickly able to get together, help each other, and just lend a helping hand and unite. Now, speaking of getting together and uniting, what better way to show that than through an IASA's blind matchmaking video? So we will be getting together athletes and we will help them find their match. So let's get on with the video. They have to have a great smile because with a great smile, you uh, it will land up your day. And yeah, um, intellect, someone who's smart. Um, the biggest thing I guess is that she gets my sense of humor. I know who this is. I don't know. I feel like mine's really specific, and if she doesn't get it, then it's kind of a downer. Um, she has to be very pretty and a nice body. <laughs> <laughs> on the rooftop, looking over the city with candles on. Um, rooftop, nice view. I'd definitely go out for dinner, like to, to a nice restaurant, you know, like not too formal, but like where we can have a good meal, like a good talk. It would be a really nice fancy restaurant, yeah, good food. It's all the same. My nickname is Sexna. <laughs> uh, I'm not that interesting. I am a three season athlete, Brazilian American. Hey, did it hurt when you fell from the sky? <laughs> I don't use pickup lines. Wait, did it hurt when you fell from heaven? Like that, that one? I've like used it like once though, but. <laughs> It, it didn't work out that well. <laughs> um, you wanna get out of here? <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, boy four, because he's a three season athlete and he's American Brazilian. Well, basically, okay, I think I was gonna choose number one in the beginning, but then. He said his nickname, and I was like, okay, no, that's a turn off. And then, um, and then I was gonna pick number four because he said, oh, I'll take it out to like a fancy dinner. Um, but then I was like, I don't know, so he said something that put me off. And then number three, I like number three because he's like, I don't use pickup lines. So I was like, I don't know, I was going to pick either, I was like, one or three, but something, I guess, like put me off with one of their answers, so uh, I think I'm going to go for four. Okay. Okay, number two seems kind of boring. Like, no offense. It was like, it was like, I'm not that interesting. Um, number four, he was like, I don't know, not vibing it. I think number one, he seems funny. Yeah. Dude, number f the answers were like, I didn't want to say, I don't know if I was about to say it, but he was a jerk. <laughs> yeah. Dude, such a jerk. 